Hello and welcome to the Swansea Sharing Academy. Here is an introduction to your Academic Challenge Progression Pack. You should all have access to a PDF of this document uh, and this is just a short introduction to go through some of the finer points. Like last year, the Sharing Masterclasses are taking place online for the foreseeable future. And this progression pack uh, is designed to support that programme, enhancing your academic study skills and supercurricular exploration. The completing of your UCAS applications is only 12 months away. So using this year to explore your subject in more depth is something will be extremely valuable and will shine through in your application. As with most programmes, we have to have a catchy acronym, and for this we have FLAIR, uh, standing for Flexibility of Thought, Love of Learning, Academic Credibility, Intellectual Curiosity, and Reading and Research. These are the five areas that underpin this academic progression pack. So this pack is structured as shown. Each section corresponds to one or more of the FLAIR criteria and the skills that you will be developing uh, are clearly highlighted in each section. This progression pack draws upon a range of resources to support your academic development. Some you may be familiar with, others not so much. The first are MOOCs massive open online courses written by the world's top universities and organizations these are free take two to three hours per week over four to six weeks and they're a fantastic addition to your supercurricular exploration podcasts articles and ted talks are things you may well be more familiar with we believe you should aim to complete at least one activity a week uh, from a section of your choice. Um, some will take less than that, um, but this is suggested as a minimum. Of course, there's going to be some periods of the year where you'll be busy with exam revision, coursework completion and such. Um, and that's absolutely fine, of course. But you may also find that some of these activities lead you to explore other ones that aren't in the pack. And if that's the case, fantastic. Please go ahead and explore that resource. This pack is designed as a framework to support your exploration in a supercurricular manner. It is not a straitjacket. So the first section here uh, shows how you will be encouraged to develop your broader academic study skills that you will need as an undergraduate at a research intensive university. These skills will help you develop the basis of a scholarly approach to learning that fits with the objectives, aims and expectations of university education. You'll develop your critical thinking skills alongside more practical study skills. The academic flair skills you are developing will be signposted in each task and as you can see they are colour coordinated also. Intellectual curiosity is really at the heart of this progression pack. And this is where you can go into the specific supercurricular exploration that suits your subject preferences. On the links below, you will find a range of subject specific resources that have been created specifically for the purpose of developing your intellectual curiosity. Following this, the section is further divided into 14 sections according to subject. Some of you may be very fixed on a subject choice for university already. Others of you might have a broader base of options. In that case, have a look at the vast range of opportunities and activities provided within this booklet and take your pick accordingly. And just finally, to signpost the final page of this document, these are the masterclasses that have been prepared for this autumn term. These will be added to uh, as the year goes ahead. So please pay close attention to the CRN team if you're a Gower College student or to your emailing list or from any bulletins that come out from your 
uh, teachers if you were in a sixth form school in Swansea. The links for all of these sessions are found in the far right column, uh, which are tiny URL hyperlinks. If you have any trouble accessing these sessions, please use the email addresses uh, of the host, which are found in the fourth column along. These sessions, as I said previously, are all being delivered via Microsoft Teams. All you need is an internet connection and you should be able to access the lectures directly. If for any reason you are unable to access the lectures at the time specified, which is between 5 and 6 o'clock on Wednesday evenings, you will be able to access these videos in retrospect, so you will not miss any of the sessions at all. Good luck. Please use this pack effectively. It is really, really beneficial to complete as many of these activities as possible. And we look forward to seeing you develop over the next 12 months.